Hey guys, Kenny with Ugly Tent. I found a really good deal on a 100% uh, wool blanket. Once again, my uncle pulled through and, and introduced me to some new gear, and this was the EKTOS. I'm not sure how you pronounce it, Ectos, Ectos. Anyway, it's a 100% wool blanket, and it's dirt cheap. Let me get out of the box and show you what we got. Whoa. So here it is. And it is a very big wool blanket. It is 100% wool. It weighs five and a half pounds, so it is a little bit on the heavy side, but it's 100% wool, what do you expect? And it is 66 inches by 90 inches, or 168 by 229 centimeters. And this one comes in navy blue. I'm not seeing it in any other colors besides the navy blue. Navy blue is dark enough to suit me. So we're gonna give this a try. This is part of my gear list that I'm preparing for a big adventure. I'll be going to Dave Canterbury's basic survival class. And this is, it's a four day course. It used to be a three day course and he's extended it to four days. So I'm excited about that. But a queen size wool blanket is one of the requirements for this class. And this is uh, the best deal I could find. The thing with this, and this is not an affiliate of mine, so I don't get any money off this or any commission or any anything at all. And the other deal with this is when I bought this, it was $47. They've raised it a dollar, it's $48. I think the first time I looked at it, it was actually cheaper. It was 40, I wanna say 45 maybe. Anyway, I thought, I'm pretty sure my uncle got it cheaper than that too. So what they're doing, appears to me like they're raising the price with the uh, supply and demand. Um, it's got 83 reviews with four and a half stars. So appears to be a quality blanket, but let's open this thing up and take a better look at it. And I don't know what the difference is on wools. Someone told me that there's a difference in the wools. There's like a compressed wool. There's more of a um, light woven wool. I don't know the differences, but it is a very, I don't wanna say it's a felt, but it is very, maybe it's just where it's new. It's very compressed. I'll have to get you a close up of that. But it is, it's a dandy. Yeah, I mean, it's it's good and heavy. It is, you can't see the light through it. It looks like it's pretty tightly woven. Let's, compl let's compare it to my other wool blanket. That way we have something to look at. Here we go. Yeah. Now, I don't know if this is because this has been washed a few times. This has been washed once or twice. But this is not quite as heavy and the loft is different. Yeah, a big difference. Yeah, wow. So, this is a 70-30 wool blend, and I can already tell a huge difference. So this should work out really well. And for that price, I think I paid 20 for this, and this is twice the blanket. And you know that you can't and you can't beat the price on this. So let's look at this up close. There you go. It's got a nice sewn edge on it. And it is tight. Now compare it to I compare it to my uh 7030 wool blanket, which I found to be extremely useful and extremely warm. Yeah, there's no comparison. Of course, this was an army surplus blanket, you know, 20 bucks. But look, you can see the light through it. I don't know if you can see it or not. There's no light coming through this one. And of course, this is lightly woven. This is a tighter weave. So again, I don't know the difference, but you can tell there's a big difference in the quality. So I'm real happy with this, especially for the price. And if I don't like it for some reason, I can always use it to make a, uh, one of those wool shirts. And there's a name for it. Now I'm sure I'm gonna get people commenting, telling me what the name of it is. Boreal shirt, maybe? I can't remember. Anyway, 
Um, I, I'll use it for something if I don't like it for a blanket, but I have a feeling I'm gonna like this one. Probably be my new go-to wool blanket, and we might use the old one to do something like a shirt or, or do something else with it. So I hope this gear review was helpful. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you're looking for a wool blanket, 100% wool blanket on the cheap, uh, I think this is the best Doug one right now. So thanks for watching another episode of Ugly Tent, and I'll see you next time.